Hi guys, we're playing a new game today which is dropped from the developers of Techland and this is Dying Light 2. Just released on the 4th of February 2022. So spoiler alert if you want to play this game yourself. Civilization is a vulnerable thing, a whim of circumstance. At any time, the smallest flap of a butterfly's wings may set catastrophe in motion. Haran, an entire city wiped from the map. Those left behind there did not stand a chance. The world's greatest minds came together and found a vaccine against the Haran virus. Finally, mankind had prevailed against the disease. But people always want more. Despite a promise to shutter its labs, the GRE continued its research in secrecy for military purposes. It didn't take long for a variant of THV to escape into the world once more. The fall happened more rapidly than anyone could have predicted. The few who survived now live in small enclaves. The only means of contact between distant human settlements are lone individuals, brave or desperate enough to travel on their own across dangerous wastelands. They are known as pilgrims. Somewhere on the map, one city is still standing. A city isolated from the outside world. A city with special rules. Now, it's the last bastion of humanity. A chance for us to learn from history. And for once, make the right choices. Because every choice you make here shapes the future. Irreversibly. That's one of the key features of this game, is that your choices matter. Okay. So this is going to be a cold playthrough of this game. Uh, I haven't played this one before, obviously. I played the Dying Light game all the way through, which was the, the first version of this game. And uh, it was really cool. The thing I like about the Dying Light games is the, the parkour system that they have. It's really well done. I've also played Techland's earlier games, the Dead Island series. Tap or hold 3 for changing weapons, okay. from the Zomboids, obviously. <laughs> yep. Nice work. See ya. <laughs> Good intro. Okay. This game used to be more fun. And <laughs> you used to be younger. And <laughs> dumber. What matters is, you're still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim yeah, is a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. All right, Pilgrim's Path. Let's do it. Climb the ledge. Maybe not there. Over 
this way. Okay, so hold the jump key for space. Shit, man. You're still strong. <laughs> Can't get up there. Up this way. And do a long jump across. Thanks. Hey, bro. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Come. I want to show you something. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. Oh, you've been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. So are you. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Seriously, I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts left and a ramshackle fence. <laughs> Look at that. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. <laughs> uh, no way. Ooh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here too. Okay, let's collect us some resources. So I grab some honey. I guess I'll just stick my hand right in there. <laughs> Survivor sense on the Q key. Okay. Find the chamomile. So I need two chamomile. I can hear another beehive too. <laughs> if you're testing my patience, friend, you're doing really well. Okay, up here. Yeah, this will do. Do you remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh yeah, the one that had that saying, uh... Remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you, you just might go on living. Alright, we've got ourselves a medicine blueprint. Press I to go to the crafting menu. So one honey and two chamomile. So crafting parts, crafting components. Craft parts are here on the right. Hit the blueprint, hold the left button down. Crafted ourselves some medicine. Come on, we're almost there. Last place. This is it. Come on. I think the gardener's not doing his job there. Wow. <laughs> Somebody had a nice crib. Damn it. Locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. Okay, search the house. Garage is open. So, C key to crouch. Look for 
for any uh, materials around the place. Q key to use your survivor sense. Oh yeah, lights up everything. I'm nothing here. So, okay, an old newspaper. Saran. Is there any hope left for the thousands of people trapped in Haran? Last spring party of 2023. Party? Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. Dance like it's the end of the world. <laughs> Locked. Something in this other room. What the? Oops. Hey, everything all right? Yeah, just rats. I think it's time we parted ways. Why? I'm starting to worry about you. And you know our saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. <laughs> Interesting policy. <laughs> okay, let's open some of these boxes. Some rice. What else we got? Resin. Yeah, I think with this game, I'm basically just going to try and pick up as much stuff as I can as I go yeah, along. Nothing in here. It's very craft oriented, so try and keep up the resources. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. Voodoo, you voodoo. Hmm. Sounds familiar. And that's what they called art? Oh, peg. Nada. Zip. Scraps. Some more bags over here. Rags. Rags might be good for bandages. I guess we'll see. Sorry, Dave. Goodbye. <laughs> it's like they died writing goodbye. That's heartbreaking. 
There's nothing like a party to celebrate the end of the world. They died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky, too. I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. Now these guys are going to spring to life. <laughs> see what we can find here. Press the Q key. Okay, there's two more investigation points. See the resemblance. At least they had each other. Someone's going for a swim. She was classy. <laughs> classy. I don't know why that's funny, it just is. Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Hey, come here. Check this out. Up in the party veranda up top. Let's go and have a look. Nice place. Needs a bit of uh, reno work. I find the stairs to the second floor. Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? Nice. A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it. By the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Here. A little baseball bat. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Yeah, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. Wh who? Doesn't matter. Not seen. I tracked down that guy for you. What guy? What, what, what guy? Quit pretending. You became a pilgrim to track that fucker down. Waltz, I found someone who knows him. Why didn't you say so earlier? Hey, what? And you're only telling me now? <laughs> when I tossed you a beer, thought you'd guess right away we were celebrating. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly he knows something about Waltz. Villador. So I'm that close, huh? Hey, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary, it's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. And where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. Boom, something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected. And suddenly, they're knocking on our doors. All right. But you owe me one. Uh, not just one. 
So what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Totally me to hear from you soon. Do you know what he wants in return? What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? <laughs> You're an old fart who likes racing me, and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe, well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. Eyes? I was gonna say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're gonna live there. No one's gonna drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. And that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah. Yeah, one day. Well, <sighs> my time's up. So when will I see you again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. <laughs> Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy, or whoever you're looking for. And remember, 140.200 megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you. Yep, burning it into my memory. Okay. Cool, <laughs> gotta get to the radio antenna. Just up on the hill there. So next objective. Head back down then. Just checking if there's any more supplies on the way out. I think I've picked it clean. <laughs> oh, what's this? Hide area, okay. Can hide from zombies under the piano. Alright. Need to head to the radio antenna. Don't think there's anything else here. So that's probably the end of this episode, guys. I'll venture forth to the uh, antenna in the next episode. Thanks for watching, click like and subscribe to see more in this series, Dying Light 2. We'll see you next time.